What you're taking a look at is a live look at the Doppler radar right now. So tornadoes have just been sweeping through the southern plains. They're dangerous tornadoes destroying people's neighborhoods. And Larry Sprinkle joining me now. Larry, the thing is, what we're seeing on the radar is it's still very active. Yeah, there's a lot. Of, at the moment, no tornado warnings, mm -hmm. but they've had a lot of flood warnings. Obviously, that's severe been thunderstorm warnings, and that's going to continue all day. That, Unfortunately, that whole area is in for more, possibly even tornadoes this afternoon. It's an unfortunate situation. In addition to the amount of rainfall, anywhere from about seven to ten inches more rain expected from Oklahoma down into Texas. And these people have yeah. been getting hammered since this weekend, yeah. really, this it's past been weekend. Day after day of severe weather. The crazy and miraculous part about all of it really is no injuries have been reported, no fatalities, and that's kind of rare for these situations. Well, one of the one of the situations we have today is the warnings are so much more in advance now. Mm -hmm. You're talking about anywhere from maybe 15 to 30 minutes, so the warnings are out there. People have a chance to go to a place of safety. That's the good news about and what happens to them. Yeah, not always the case. We are hearing from people in these areas just talking about how they're thankful to be alive. Take a listen. I could just see the whole house blowing away, you know. So thank God that it didn't. The Lord was good. We're here. All of a sudden, and the roof was gone. You're looking up at the sky. And as you just heard Larry talking about those people, you know, I think we have a light out, you guys. So just keep that in mind when we're looking at some of these things. Maybe we could zoom in on some of these pictures to actually show you as I step out of the way. The tornado damage in the path of the visible fields right there. This is in Oklahoma. You can see just the roof completely missing from this area right there. So many shots of just people, you know, spotting these tornadoes as they're driving through Oklahoma. We see, look at that. That's just a huge tornado right there in Mangum, Oklahoma. That was, you know, as someone was out there watching a lot of storm chasers catching a lot of these as well. This is in Nebraska. So this is covering multiple states. You guys many of the issues in Oklahoma right there by Texas by the Texas state line. Incredible videos from viewers. As you can see in this tweet, this is right outside of someone's home. This is a tweet from someone that works over there at the National Weather Service, Emily Sutton. But that is what people are seeing outside their windows. And I think that's what's so incredible. They're being urged to stay indoors, urged to find safety. But look at that. Ben and Carolyn, if you were driving down the street and you came across, it looks like a movie. It looks like a scene out of Twister. Again, just one of the many, many tweets, Facebook posts, Instagram videos that we're seeing online this morning. Wow. Just want, want to remind people in any situation like this, I know this is happening in the Midwest, but be safe when you try to capture these videos right. because it is scary. And because they can change so quickly the path sure. of something like that.